Yo, what up, YouTube? Power Tower here, and here's a few tips and tricks to get you started in Black Desert Online. So, you can take everything I say with a grain of salt. I know what I'm talking about, but you can always argue, oh, you, you have two level 30s and a level 14. You don't even have a max level character. What makes, you know, you eligible to give tips? Well, go fuck yourself. <laughs> uh, here's a few tips. Uh, so, first tip... Don't take every single quest you get. Um, so, like, side quests, not all quests are worth get, uh, taking. Uh, I would suggest just following the main story quest and mob grinding. Those are the best ways to level up in the game. Uh, mainly mob grinding. Uh, even taking the uh, side quests aren't really worth it all the time. Um, they just give very little XP. Even, like, seriously, it's horrible, the quests. Uh, so just go mob grind. That's all I'm going to tell you. Just mob grind. That's the only way to level up. Uh, this is not like any other MMORPG out there. Uh, this is a very unique game. Um, it is not like, say, Guild Wars 2 or WoW. It is not like those games at all. Uh, mob grinding is one of the best ways to level up. While in most games, you do quests. You go turn them in. You get XP. In this game, it's more like you do a quest, you do another quest, you do another quest, you do another quest, you do another quest. Then you get your XP, and it's shit. So, make sure that you're mainly mob grinding, and yeah, you, everything's unique. Make sure you choose the character that suits your playstyle. So you get multiple choices, of course, like any other game. Um, you have a ninja. You have a freaking whatever else ninja you have uh archer you have berserker you have all these classes make sure to choose the one that you want to and main it don't just create tons of all characters like i do uh it's kind of like it's very counterproductive uh you don't get as much from it so make sure you do that next tip when fishing you can auto fish which means you can go offline and you can be fishing the whole time and it's the best way to make money is fishing i'll tell you that right now you want to make easy money go fish sells like each fish you catch is around fifteen hundred dollars or fifteen hundred silver and that definitely adds up when you're auto fishing when you're afk very very easy way to make money also when you exchange your gold ignits uh, you get them free in the game. Uh, you go to the storage unit. You place it in there. You exchange your funds. You go to the bank. You pull that money out if you want it. Because, honestly, uh, another thing that I have to counter is weight. Lots of silver. Silver counts as weight. So does all your items. So make sure you're not too heavy or you'll go super slow. And, you know, you, the adventure will be a lot less fun. Um, next tip. Uh, make sure that you profit from your contribution points doing things yourself is for suckers so put your contribution points to good use and make hired npcs workers do the lifting for you make sure that they are the ones that are making you the money and you're not doing it yourself um explore for knowledge so t every single time you see a quest or a icon a quest icon over someone's head take it make sure that you get that knowledge because knowledge is very important for your map very important for you learning new enemies and it's very important for you unlocking new things in the game uh there's always something to do while afk like i said there's fishing there's making your workers go mine stuff or find stuff you know uh, make sure to always do that uh horses are more than just mounts getting your first horse can be exciting if only because you can get your places from faster than your foot but, did you know that they're a lot more important than that for selling and buying other things? Um, so that's very important. Uh, <clears throat> so yeah, I think that's all the tips I can really give you guys. Uh, other than joining a guild, uh, I'm not even in a guild. Um, sadly, uh, I can't talk in the chat because I don't have a, a megaphone. Speaking of megaphone, I should talk about that too. A megaphone is an item that lets you talk in the chat. Um, you After you use one... That's it. You have one, and then you have to go buy another one. So I just don't think it's... I think it's a huge waste of money, so I, I don't buy megaphones. Um, but that's just me. You guys can go buy all the megaphones you want to talk in chat and find a guild. Because it's very important um, for leveling up. So if you guys enjoyed the video and this helped out, please like, comment, subscribe, whatever you want to do. Love you guys. Power Tower G out. Peace.